Good morning. Bit better uh, this week, Mrs. Snow. Yes, no snow today. It's uh, it's a lovely winter's morning. It's I think actually we're into double figures. I think it's about ten degrees. T-shirts. So where are we going? Today it's another motorhome stopover. We're going to stay at the Sun Inn, which is in a, a tiny little village called Norwood, um, just west of Harrogate. Um, it's, uh, it's over over 250 years. It's been an inn, so we're hoping to um, to have some nice period features. Uh, and today's activity is we're going to walk around Swinsty Reservoir, which is walkable from the pub. The the two reservoirs together, there's the Swinsty and the uh, Fuston. And the, to give you an idea of um, where it is, the, the top of Fuston Reservoir uh, is at Blubber Houses, which is on the um, A59 Skipton Road. But today we're just going to walk around Swinsty. So, we've got the dogs in the back. Dogs. They don't need the fleece coats today. We've got us walking boots. We're going to enjoy a nice walk and then... Um, ooh, um, what do you think we might do, Slow? We're off to the pub. <laughs> Fancy that. So we're booked in for a meal, um, staying overnight in the car park, in the motorhome. Um, so come along with us and enjoy our adventures today. Let's go. So, parked up, fridge on, backpack on, wife, boots on, dogs, not going to the pub, walkie time. What are you doing? Hello! Smell of the country. Definitely a smell of the country. Hello there. Bye then. Wait for me. Oh, okay. I'm going to go on my backside soon. Ooh, ooh. Slippy, slippy. It's fine. You just filmed me with two dog leads trying to get through a gate. I can manage. I will. Multitasker. You always tell me how you're good at multitasking. You ladies. Yeah. Don't fall over, will you? Come on, Bill. Come on. <laughs> Look at his paws. We'll have to put you in the reservoir. They were only at dog groomers yesterday. You said to me that it wasn't a muddy walk. The reservoir part isn't. Oh. Know about this Is this the only way to it? Well, unless you go right along the road. Okay. No, but Bill. Billy, why have you done that? Oh my word. Look at your paws. <laughs> Look it, back over here, come on. This way. Look at all boys together, listen to mummy, we're going this way. Oh, what's this tree? Yep, oh, thank you. <laughs> Stupid. 
Tchou. I think there's a lot of trees falling over here. Yeah. Let's see. Yeah. <laughs> Come on, Bill. Come on. What's that? Big tree. Yeah. Oh. Rotten. So rotten. Hi. Hi. Dog's back on leads. Did you say you were going to do some cold water swimming? No, not today. It'll be a good day. Mm. Uh, we've run into a problem. We have. This is a, a Yorkshire water walk, um, which you can get off the internet, and it's for a walk around Swinsty Reservoir, here. So, we parked up at the pub, and we came down this footpath here, from the pub, and when we got to here, we saw the sign. But we couldn't work the sign out. We knew there was going to be something closed, but we couldn't work out where it was. So we've walked down here to this point, and this is where we've got it. But it says there alternative footpath route, but it doesn't show it going round and linking up at the, at the other side. No, but we found this map. Uh. This map's good because this map shows here. This is the pub, and we walked down this footpath here, and around here, and this is where it's blocked. So we can't go down there, round there, or up there. So we're not going to get a circular walk. So we're going to turn round, go back, walk up here, um, and just enjoy being outside in this lovely winter's day. It's, uh, it's very mild, very mild indeed. It's not windy. The dogs are enjoying the walk. And Slo can smell the pub from here. Can. So, let's go back that way. Return to send. <laughs> Come on. I think that's broken, isn't it? It's a lovely walk around this reservoir. Very, um, very accessible, very flat, easy to walk on, lots of benches. So we would recommend it if you are um, not fit or recovering, like <laughs> or recovering from anything, or you've got a buggy with you or a wheelchair. Yeah. Or a dog, or a cat. Why? Or a hamster. Why? Well, that, because a cat and a dog hamster can go on here. Snake. Lake. To the reservoir, yeah, this is Fuston. We're at the top point, we're going to have to turn now because um, we can't get down the other side. So we've walked up here and across the banking. And there's no point us going down there because you can't get round. So we're going to turn round and go back that way. Let's do it.
again. It's getting dark. It's not getting dark at all. There's about an hour and a half left of daylight. It looks dark to me. It's only because you're under trees. Oh. <laughs> sun, there's no sun. No, sun's dropped. Man, it's dropping. up there actually. Dropping. It's cold though, it's cold. Gloves, gloves, gloves. Gloves. We should be going, we should be going up there. But we've decided, as you will have seen, when we arrived, state of it coming down here. Really muddy. I think we're going to just do the road. I think so. Oh. That road. Come on, buddy. I haven't mentioned pub yet. You did? When? Back there. Did I? Oh. <laughs> I'll mention it again. It's 4.30. And slow's thirsty. Let's go, come on. I've only got little legs. You're right. <laughs> Straight up there. It's like it's going to be close till summer 22. Never mind. <sighs> Aren't you busy? <laughs> yeah. Is it? I'm hoping it's not going to jump over and get me when I'm eating. Looks a bit uh, fierce, no. doesn't it? What is it? A mink? An otter? I don't know what it is. Uh -huh. Put it in the comments if anybody knows. Looks scary anyway. Mm, I know things that look scary. Mm. Just trying to look at Vifi. Cheers. Salt air blonde, then we're doing um, landlord, Timmy Taylor's landlord, and Timmy Taylor's bolt maker, I think. Um, bed. I'm on Birra Moretti to start. I shall probably have uh, a glass of red when I've had a peruse of the menu and decide what I want to have for my tea. But I'm just trying to get on the Wi Fi. I'm trying to upload my walk. My name. Is Michael K. Now, oh, there we go, I'm on. Super. This is a really nice pub. It's the, really nice. Yeah, the beer's cracking. Um, looking on the website, this place opened as an inn in 1771, so over 250 years ago it opened as an inn, and it's got some beautiful features. That fireplace is just awesome. Um, mm. And the, the stone walls, we've been talking to um, one of the young girls that's waiting on, and um, apparently this place may have some um, presents yeah, in, no. the, in the cellar, yeah, yeah. in the cellar, she yeah, thinks. Yeah. Yeah. Well, they're keeping good beer. If they're looking after the cellar, definitely. So we'll see. No, I'm not recording. I'm not coming out at night to with my camera to try and find. We'll see if they knock on our door tonight. Nah, they won't do. But we do know who this is. It's an otter. I wasn't sure, but it's a fearsome looking otter. Mm, I won't mess with that. No. Cheers. We'll have another cheers. Why not? Cheers. Happy Saturday. Mm. Happy Saturday indeed. We like our Saturdays out. Saturday morning, well, you know that we both work full time. So Saturday morning, I get all my jobs done. We set off at lunchtime Saturday. We go and have an adventure. And today's walk was five and a half mile, I think. Unfortunately, it couldn't be circular because the path was closed. Um, and then we come to the pub for tea and stop over in the car park and we're home for lunchtime the next day so we like our Saturdays out but you like coming with us yeah can't beat it beats sitting at home looking at missus at least in pub I can look at Oi. other missus <laughs> can I say that not sure where this is going no I'm not quite sure actually no I think you should cut it there there's not a fruit bowl in here is there cut it there cut cut 
So if you come here in the winter, come scantily clad in clothing and because of the heat in this oh. place. <laughs> it's warm as toast. It's yeah. toasty. That fire is blazing, but not only is the fire blazing. There's heat covering out at the back of these. It's like Barbados on acid. I'm a Barbadian. I feel like I should go back to Helga and put a t-shirt on, I think. Well, enjoy it because I'm not using any gas. <laughs> We're warming up in here. Yeah. <laughs> You'll be able to cool down. Don't you? I'll need to do. Ladies of a certain age can't cope with this heat, I'll have you know. Billy. Somebody's going back to Motor and will be put to bed. You are naughty. Get under it. Get under yeah, when you go pee and pee. My God, lad. When you go pee and pee. Hey. Believe it. Slaw thinks that that... Slaw thinks that that piece of leather over there is bondage. It's blinkers. Slaw's blinking. Well, pea hunting. What are you Lasagna and garlic bread. Oh, you what? Oh, you what? Slow. I don't know. Hunter's chicken. Mm. Yeah, I looked at Hunter's chicken. It's C'est possible. <laughs> There's some good choices on here. Good chicken choices. Chicken Joel Frazee. Um, and it's very reasonably priced. Looks yeah. like it's going to be just good pub grub at pub prices, which um, makes a change. You know, you've got um, a rump steak on there for ten ninety five. Bad. Yeah. Although you'd have to see what the steak's like. Oh $10. yeah. Ten ninety five. I've had a ten ninety five steak before. Not here. <laughs> Um, no. Yes, but you have actually. Think about but it. I, Think about where you've had a really good steak at that sort of money. £10.95? Yeah. We, I, don't, I don't even think it was that much. Really? Stratton Arms at Tur Western. Oh, yeah. Stratton, yeah. Arms, yeah. Stratton Arms at Tur Western. Lizard's cooking. Good quality. Home cooked food. Two of them. Yeah. Two of them. At very reasonable prices. This menu smacks of Stratton Arms. So it does. I'm, yeah, I'm looking forward to it. I did look at the homemade steak pie, yeah. but I had pie last week. I've got to stop eating pies. It's going to be singing to me soon, aren't you? Who wet all the pies? Who wet all the pies? Uh, yeah, stop the pies, Anne. There's one here. Kick, a, kick ass chicken. <laughs> yeah. You get the kicking, I'll kick ass. Kick ass chicken. Chicken fillet coated in Cajun spice. Topped with beef, chilli and cheese. Ooh. That sounds good. Mm. Yeah. This is Slow's going to loot. Slow on. Man power. And I've drunk more than her. What's that about? Come in, come in, come in. Look at all this cheese again. Oh, it's too much cheese. Cheese fest. Oh, no, but it's good. Mm. Oh, we're going to be chicken now. We had chicken feet tea last night. We had chicken feet tea tonight. And I'm, putting, good for you. and I'm putting the leftover chicken and an aubergine and tomato curry tomorrow night. No. <laughs> You're going to win. Bring it on. Chicken is good. Stop it. Kick ass chicken. <laughs> oh dear. Yeah, I think so. Back to Helga, Mrs. Slow. Yeah. 
Indeed. Oh. Oh, hang on. Somebody's having a drink. Shut the door, it's Come on, this That's chilly. We've had a lovely meal in the pub this evening and we've come out and there is a beautiful night sky. So hopefully if we turn the camera around you can see what we can see. And um, we're going to go inside then and have a little tipple before bed. Have a look at these stars. Because it's freezing. Have a look at these stars. Good morning. Good morning. We've left the pub. We have. We had a lovely night's sleep. Um, we were the only motorhome on the car park. Um, very quiet road. Um, but we were awoken quite early this morning with the Beacocks. Mm. <laughs> who were... Um, they were being murdered. Yeah. <laughs> they were making a right racket. Um, jumping up and down all over the pub roof as well. So yes. we've, we've left the pub and, um, well, you say where you want it to come slow. Where are we? Well, we're just by uh, Leeds Bradford Airport. Thought we'd just uh, pop in and uh, have a little look. And Mrs. Slaw needs to make me breakfast, so. Yep, I'm going to make a full breakfast while Slaw watches the planes. Um, and I might even strangle Billy, because every time we turn the camera on, he starts crying. He don't, it's because he's not in it. Yeah, attention seeking. Yeah. So, I'll kind of come with cooking. You get on with looking. Uh, plane spotting. Although there's none, nothing at the moment, but uh, hopefully soon. I do have a flight tracker app, so I'm monitoring. Right, make my breakfast. I'm making it. Get it on with you. So I brought all the ingredients with me from home um, in my Tupperwares, because Slaw had a, a breakfast yesterday before we set off. I've got the oven on, ready, because we've only got limited space in here. So when the meat's cooked, I'm going to put it in the oven to keep it warm while I do the, the rest of it. So. Crack on. Mickey Slaw's top tip. Use an empty margarine container for your sponges, plugs, dishcloths. Just save them from rolling round in the cupboard. Although they cook on the edges, they don't cook very well in the middle, so always split them. Okay, so sausages are cooked, so I'm going to put them into um, this foiled lined tin to keep them warm in the oven while I cook everything else. Mushrooms and tomatoes going in now. Really ready for the eggs. There we go. All done. Ready to plate up. Meat in the oven keeping warm. Mushrooms and tomatoes in the big pan. Beans and scrambled egg in the smaller two pans. Just missing black pudding but that's my fault. I um, didn't realise and forgot to buy it. So, on to the plates.
looks good, Mrs. Slaw. Full breakfast in the motorhome. Does it look all right, Slaw? Beautiful. Crack on, Mum. We'll tuck in. I do for slow. Let the breakfast go cold to film a blooming plane coming in. Sorted. <laughs> Thank you so much for coming with us this weekend. Hope you've enjoyed it. It's been lovely weather. We've been so lucky. We had a lovely walk yesterday. Great meal in the pub. Slow been plane spotting. And now we're heading home. So if you like what you've seen, give us a thumbs up. If you want to follow us on more of our adventures, please subscribe. And if you want to be notified when we upload more content, don't forget to ring that bell. You can catch us on Facebook and Instagram for real-time updates. But until next time, friends, bye! Bye!